So Craig, a 2-1 defeat here tonight, what were your thoughts on the game? Uh, disappointing, two bad goals we give away, we had a few chances, we didn't take our chances and that's what happens, they, they, they're fighting for their lives, fair play to them, they kept going to the end and obviously they scored a late goal. Uh, two bad goals by us really, uh, goals we, we could do better with um, as a team, how easy they got in and obviously the last one with the ball in behind and stuff like that. Things we can definitely work on and obviously chances wise we had a few chances that on another day they would have gone in so it was one of them days tonight. I don't think we played as well as we have done in the recent weeks but uh, yeah it's disappointing because obviously we was on a bit of a good run but fair play to them they kept going to the end and obviously they got the win. It's the end of your seven match and beaten run and you, as you say you've, you've defended well in recent weeks does that make it even more frustrating than oh, yeah. the result tonight? Yeah, it does because obviously once we got back to 1-1, we should be going going and winning the game and, and we didn't. Um, we lost the game and obviously uh, people who were here tonight, obviously seeing the chances we had, we should have done better. They had a couple of chances but nowhere near as, as many as us and obviously they put the ball in the back of the net at the end, which is disappointing but I just think at times today we could have been better on the ball, quality into the box, little passing and just general play, we could have been a lot better. It was tough conditions out there but still no excuse, we, we can still be better. How does that change your, your role as a centre-half um, when the wind's like that? You know, first half um, it was going against you, but in the second half it was uh, going with you. How does that, you have to be uh, more, uh, concentrate more? I suppose? Yeah, concentrate, because obviously the ball's swirling around. I think uh, defensively, me, defensively me and Deck did well tonight. I don't think they caused us many problems, but obviously we've lost the game 2-1, so people will be looking at the defence and seeing what happens. Uh, but no, you just uh, play to the conditions and I think uh, as, a, as a back four tonight, I think we did well but obviously we've conceded two goals and that's the disappointing thing. Callum Ball uh, scored a, a very good goal tonight and uh, it's actually the first time you've lost a game that he's scored in. Yeah. Um, how, what's his influence been like since? Yeah, very good. Ball is a good player, um, scores a lot of goals for us, uh, brings a lot to the team and obviously we need to keep him fit because obviously he's our main goal scorer at the minute, him and Pellet have, of a combined to, for a good partnership and uh, Borley does very well but obviously Pellet is a good partner for him as well and they, they, I think they work well together. Um, finally you've got Halzo in a way on Saturday, uh, what are your thoughts heading into that one, uh, yes. similar area in the table yes, to, it's another, to Brickley? It's another tough game, Halzo and Big, big uh, be fighting for their lives you know. Um, we've got to go there on Saturday and, and perform better than what we did tonight maybe start trying to concede silly goals like we are conceding at the minute uh, and obviously get back to winning ways and that's the main thing. We've got a training session on Thursday that we're going to work hard and, and then come back uh, for Saturday and obviously try and get the three points. That's the main thing at this time of the season.